All aboard the Polar Express. Coming up in this video, we take an overview of the 2017 release of the Scale Polar Express Berkshire from Lionel. Stay tuned. Welcome back to the channel if you're a subscriber, and welcome if you're just new here. I hope you're having a great holiday season. Christmas Eve 2023. What better day to take a look at the 2017 catalog Scale Polar Express Berkshire that I purchased. We'll also take a look at the cars I'm pulling behind it. We've already seen the uh, Polar Bipolar, or as I like to call it, the Tripolar. And Lionel has had a great, great success releasing Polar Express ready to run sets and other scale locomotives and even um, rolling stock. So on this Christmas Eve 2023, I thought the only video I could do is the Polar Express. So we're going to take a look at the engine, some of the cars. And then we're just going to take a look at it running around the layout. The Polar Express Scale Berkshire Locomotive. Road number 1225, of course, for Christmas. And this is a beautiful steam locomotive. Lionel did an excellent job on this locomotive. It has whistle steam. It has uh, smokestack steam. It has firebox glow. Of course, all the legacy features. Um, from the 2017 Air Volume 2 was when this was cataloged. And this was product number 6-84685. And I believe this is the last Polar Express scale locomotive that they made. So what that means is we're due. But this being Christmas Eve, I thought this would be a great time to do a quick overview of this locomotive um, and the cars that I'm pulling behind it. Beautiful steam locomotive. Um, beautiful details, great amount of uh, uh, sound clips that are in it, just beautiful overall. So let's go ahead and start her up and go through some of the sound clips. And then from there, we're going to take a look at some of the cars that I got pulling behind it. Um, I opted to purchase the cars with the snow on the roof, and uh, not, unfortunately, I can't fit them all behind this uh, engine on this layout. So we'll look at what I got going here, and then we'll just get some runtime in. So let's go ahead and start her up. There's your whistle steam. Let's uh, listen to some of the dialogue from the movie. You coming? Uh, I want to. Watch the ship, please. One thing about trains. It doesn't matter where they're going. What matters is deciding to get on. Why, to the North Pole, of course. All aboard! This is the Polar Express. And with that, what better way to start looking at the next set of cars as we move out? All right. This is the Scale Polar Express Reindeer car. Now, I actually did a review on this. Um, it's a very popular review. Basically, Lionel created a freight car slash uh, uh, stock car that has reindeer sounds. Um, it has a loading sequence. Okay, we're ready. Give them the go. Nicely done. Make 
sure those water tanks are full. Throw a couple extra hay bales in there. Nicely done. And it has an unloading sequence. Arrived at the North Pole. Let's get them unloaded. All right. All right. Give the girls some room. That's how we do it. A really fun car and a great addition to the Polar Express. Next, what I'm pulling behind here is... And by the way, the reindeer car also has the squeal, wheel squeal and other sounds. Now this is the um, marionette car from the Polar Express movie. Pretty nice car. Doesn't uh, really have any uh, functionalities, but it does have, if you can see in the windows, the marionettes hanging there. This is the Lionel Polar Express. I'm going to turn down the engine a little bit so we can hear some of these. This is the Polar Express Sound Diner car, also known as the Hot Chocolate car. Now, unfortunately, um, I have to believe due to um, licensing, they never did get the Hot Chocolate song in it. But it does have all the fun uh, diner car sequences. And, and sound clips from the movie. Attention travelers, the Polar Express is now boarding. There is the North Pole. Your attention please, the Polar Express is now boarding. So it does have a uh, random sequence of movie quotes and it also has the uh, sound dying or sequences that we expect from Lino. The next car is one of the standard coaches that come with the um, as an add-on set. I think it came in part of a four-pack. I can't remember. It's been a while ago. Um, no, actually, it was. These were all uh, separate sale items, but um, it was also cataloged in 2017. It was just, as I said, it's just a coach. We'll move on. And of course, you can't have a Polar Express without the hobo on the roof. Um, as you can see, it features a uh, hobo sitting on the, the roof of the Polar Express coach with flame going. Um, very beautiful car. This was actually uh, cataloged a little bit later, I believe in 2019, 2020. Um, another great addition to the uh, Polar Express uh, engine setup that I got here. And again, if you notice, I do have snow. The uh, I did buy the optional uh, snow-covered roofs, which uh, I, I I really like. Um, I think it adds to the cars. I know a lot of people don't necessarily like them, but I do. And finally, in this scenario, we have the scale observation car. Again, this is another beautiful car. Um, it does have a figure in it, just the uh, one boy sitting by himself. It has the curved uh, observation deck. I know a lot of people like the uh, bigger observation deck that um, was on the ready-to-run sets. And uh, some people have actually modified their observation cars for a uh, bigger observation deck. So right now, before we pull out, I'm going to get a uh, closer look at the inside of the observation car so you can see the one lonely boy sitting there by himself. And then after that, it's time to hit the rails.
get on. Well, there you have it. The Scale Polar Express and Scale Passenger Cars. What a great, great way to celebrate Christmas. Having a Scale Polar Express or any Polar Express in your uh, fleet of railroad locomotives. Lionel certainly has done an incredible job with the Polar Express trains. And with that, I think it's time to end this video. I want to thank all the new subscribers, and I want to thank all my old subscribers, and I want to thank everybody for watching the videos. This last year, we have uh, actually grown the channel quite a bit, and I appreciate that. With that, I want to wish every one of you a very Merry Christmas and a happy holiday season. I think it's time to move on. It's Christmas Eve, after all. And Santa's got a schedule. Just remember, the true spirit of Christmas lies in your heart. <laughs>